Nigel Farage made waves in the IMA Celebrity 2023 camp yesterday as he was branded shameful by Fred Siriex over Brexit. And now, Strictly Come Dancing star James Jordan has waded into their feisty debate. Strictly Come Dancing pro James Jordan has declared Fred Siriex a B asterisk 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 D following his tense row with Nigel Farage on IMA Celebrity. Get me out of here, last night. 7 million viewers tuned in to see former UK Independence Party member Nigel Rowe with TV personality Fred over the pair's opposing Brexit views. There were bound to be clashes, and James has now taken aim at Fred, branding the first date star AB asterisk 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 D in view of his more than 360,000 X, formerly Twitter, followers. However, one fan retorted in response, Good luck with this tweet. Everyone loves Fred. And another exclaimed, Fred to win. One unimpressed follower bluntly shared in the comments, Had enough of you. Bye, only for James to give her a wave in return. The debate began when Fred challenged Nigel in camp about his Brexit ambitions, quizzing. What's the benefit of Brexit then? If you are an average person from Britain, what's the benefit? Nigel responded. To know that we're independent, we stand on our own two feet in the world. Referring to a controversial poster that Nigel launched back in 2016 featuring migrants queuing, which was reported to the police at the time over fears it would stoke up racial hatred. Fred made his feelings known. Brexit was about immigration. I remember your poster. I thought it was shameful what you did, Nigel. Shameful, Fred exclaimed. Sadly, it was absolutely true. It was a poster showing mass young men moving illegally across borders, Nigel hit back. Fred challenged. But it was about demonizing migrants, only for Nigel to deny the claim. Later in the Bush Telegraph, he shared. I knew it wouldn't take long. I knew politics would rear its head as indeed it did. And Fred feels very strongly about it. Fred also claimed during his debate with Nigel that the average person in the UK has lost out because of what you've done. Food critic Grace Dent addressed the debate in her own Bush Telegraph comments, making it clear she was exhausted by the subject matter already. I would 100% rather wash up than listen to another single word about Brexit. She groaned, adding, I was just like. Oh my god, I'm going to go and put my head in that stream. Meanwhile, Twitter, X, users challenged James Jordan over his B asterisk 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 D insult towards Fred. With that Kirsty Fleeson asking him, why? Because he had a discussion with Farage? Surely key part of a democracy is open discussions. At LMWARB hit back. I thought it was quite refreshing to see two people with differing opinions actually discuss, debate and agree to disagree and move on. At Vegas S chimed in. He asked a very important question. What benefit has Brexit given you? Fred pointed out the flaws, how it's affected us all, especially the restaurant trade. At Marie McGuckin added. He's allowed his opinion. He discussed the topic reasonably and rationally. Democracy means we are all free to voice our differing views.